Imagine a name so synonymous with greatness it transcended sports, a name that could bring a stadium to its feet, a name that promised electrifying moves and highlight real jukes. Now imagine that same name plastered across every headline, not for touchdowns, but for a trial that captivated a nation. This is the story of O.J. Simpson, the juice, a tale of triumphs and tragedies, of a life tragically split in two. Breaking news, O.J. is dead. Continue until the end. O.J. Simpson burst onto the scene in the 1960s, a dazzling running back for the Buffalo Bills. He wasn't just fast, he had a captivating power, a blend of grace and brutality that earned him the nickname The Juice. He shattered records, won awards, and became a pop culture icon. His smile was infectious, his charisma undeniable. He transcended the game, becoming one of the first black athletes to endorse major brands, a symbol of progress and possibility. But then, in 1994, came the night that changed everything. The brutal murders of Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman sent shockwaves. O.J., Nicole's ex-husband, became the prime suspect. The ensuing trial became a media circus, a national obsession. The prosecution painted a picture of rage and betrayal. The defense argued for a frame-up. Racial tensions simmered just beneath the surface, a nation divided along lines of race and class. We followed the trial religiously, the car chase, the glove that wouldn't fit, the verdict that left us speechless, acquittal. The nation erupted, some celebrating what they saw as justice served, others outraged by what they believed was a miscarriage. OJ retreated from public life, a shadow of his former self. Endorsements dried up, his reputation forever tarnished. There were attempts at a comeback, a book deal here, a golf tournament there, but the magic was gone. News broke of OJ's passing after a battle with cancer. His legacy is a complex one. He was an undeniable talent, a cultural icon, but also a man forever linked to a horrific crime. How will OJ Simpson be remembered? The electrifying athlete or the man at the center of a national tragedy? The answer, likely, will depend on who you ask. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.